thought I'd give you a little preview of what we're having July the 12th at 4 p.m. Cowboy Auctions. Here is uh, some of the stuff in the case. There'll be more in there at auction time. Some nice knives and stuff like that. The trunk that we had on. A lot of NASCAR items. NASCAR racetrack. The holiday train set, Christmas set. There's actually two train sets and one in there. Dremel. Scroll saw. And some of what we have on the front tables here. These are sewing patterns under here. There's 50 in a box. Several boxes full. Older books, magazines, a little bit of everything, something for the house. There's a paddle from a bread factory or a bakery that's been decorated. Lots of Barbies. All in really good shape. Really nice clock back there. Another clock, blown glass, more blown glass, 1800s games, it's probably 1890, old maps, wall shelves, outdoor decorations, really nice sign, I don't know if this was Somebody made it. You see the back of it is like a crate. And uh, shiny bright, of course, is the older ornaments. More maps. Most of these are Wisconsin. 1800s books, or 1800s and early 1900s. CDs. Tobacco tins. Uh, sewing spool, more older games, the Ferris wheel back there, I can't really get a good shot of it here. That's 1912, somewhere in there. These are mahogany and cast iron lamps. Uh, 18, probably 78, somewhere in there. Uh, Book of Composers in the original German. Nice, nice older clock. That'll be on the site later. Another nice older clock. It's probably 1920s, maybe earlier. I'll have to get a closer look at it. Those just came in. Some nice metal racks and just a variety of everything in here. Tools, kids tools, games, tents, a lot of glassware items, big box lots of stuff. I thought I'd show you some of what we do to get ready for the auction. All these did not come in like this. They have to be sorted. In most cases, you have a estate or somebody passes away and the family just brings in boxes of stuff. And uh, we do the best we can to sort it out in the best way that it will sell. All this has not been sorted. None of this has been sorted. This box is actually throw away. Some of the linens in there just weren't up to what we want to sell or broken glass. It all still is to be sorted. And more coming in this week and and next weekend. This all came in. This is all ready to go. Other than just setting it out. Really nice terracotta chimney top. And some garden tools. And a boat shelf. Some little boats in there. 
just a little bit of everything. Bring you around here, try and bring you around slow. Really nice items there. Older kitchen cabinet. And this is what I'm talking about. See, this is just a small pile. This will all be thrown away. It's broken glass, chipped glass. Uh, just things that are not sellable. Or that anybody would want. I always tell anybody, if you wouldn't want it, don't bring it. But when you have a whole estate, you get everything. When they're cleaning out, really big, nice roll of carpet padding. Good variety of stuff there. And a bed. I think that's a full size bed. Hollywood frame. Some more garden tools. Long handle tools. I oh, won't forget this side. Got a little heart bench. And this is a brand new cabinet top. And the box next to it is the exact same cabinet top that hasn't been assembled yet. Brand new items and older items, usable items. We try and sort it out the best use possible. And you end up with a lot of box lights like there. That's just a general lot of stuff. You can see we're getting pretty full for the 12th, but we're actually going to utilize our drive-in space if we have to and make it a really good sale for everybody, a really big sale. So we're going to take off for the 4th. Dolly jack, it's a manual dolly jack and it does work. We test everything. If it works, we tell you. If it doesn't work, we tell you it needs repair. There's a go-kart. He said it does run, but you can see that it needs a tire or two. and needs some TLC to get it back to where it needs to be. Some of the items on this lot. There's a... Uh, die-cast car case it's full on both sides genie pressure washer uh, he said it does work that's one item I haven't tried we don't have really a way to hook those up some nice items back there even the sink even the kitchen sink I would say but that's a bathroom pedestal sink and you have uh, some more furniture here This is actually a uh, quartz clock. Nice clock there. Another table, lamp, lawnmower. This truck is actually sold. They're going to pick it up on the 15th. A dealer bought it. He said that uh, if I get an offer over 2000 that he would consider it. So if anybody's interested, let me know. It will be gone on the 15th. Nice variety of stuff there, some copperware, Husqvarna, 6.75 horse engine, self-propelled, nice doll cradle there. All these kids toys here work. There's the truck again. It's a 99 Dakota Sport. I think it's got 122,000 miles on it. Nice little truck for somebody. Another lot over here. Everything from golf clubs to RC cans. Older thermos there. Just about every collectible that somebody would want to collect. And it just keeps going. And we're very lucky to have uh, the 
consigners that we have. A lot of them bring it in already pre-sorted, clean, ready to go. We don't have to worry about it being broke or damaged. We still check everything anyway. Or try to. A couple nice kids bikes there. Spider-Man. This one is Glamour Girl. Over here we have an, another type of bike, exercise bike, electronic. A couple of TVs. We normally don't take these, but it was part of an estate, so we told them we would go ahead and take them. We normally don't take big TVs, mattresses, anything broken, uh, cloth furniture we don't deal in too much. It's just what will sell out there. And if I wouldn't buy it, I don't want to sell it. Cute little doll there and a little age on that doll. A little bit of everything. I thought I'd let you all see in some of the process that we go through to get things ready which is an ongoing process. And I hope you can show up on July the 12th at four o'clock. And we'll probably have a lot more stuff in here. So watch us on auctionzip.com for more items being put on. We generally add more items several times a week. So, kind of check the pictures often. And we've got an estate sale coming up. We haven't set the date on that, but I'll be signing the contract Friday. It's a six acre farm. Farmhouse will sell and all the contents. It's probably gonna be a really good sale there. So anyway, everybody come on out, July the 12th, and it's getting really stocked in here, so hopefully we'll have a good sale and get it all back out and start all over again. We'll see you then. Thanks everybody for coming out and have a safe and happy holiday weekend.